Hey everyone, Kevin here. Alright, so I'm making a jig to cut curved rafter tails. The house I'm framing has a swooping roof, or flared eaves, whatever you want to call it. And uh, I need about 50 of these rafter tails that will attach to the side of my eye joist rafters. So this jig is nothing fancy, didn't take very long to make. Uh, all it is is a guide template that the saw runs against and a backstop. So I'm going to cut three tails at a time using a Prozzi beam saw attachment for my framing saw. And these will all be cut from 2 by 12 so let's get to it Okay, got this first rafter tail tested. Everything looks good. So now I could cut the rest of them. Right, here's some other jigs I've been using. Got one for the bottom of the rafter and one for the top. Um, same thing, just a guide for the saw to go against. I put a couple strips of uh, an old yoga mat that and it helps it grip, so you don't even have to hold the uh, the jig as you cut. A couple different jigs for the blocking needed uh, on these eye joists rafters. I'm just trying to make everything as simple and repeatable as fast as possible. Uh, this one here is for the uh, the peak where the rafters meet. And uh, I didn't quite have the depth set on this one yet. needed two per rafter set and and 
just don't be afraid to make a jig. It's going to save you a lot of time. If anyone's interested in me going further into depth on some of these jigs, I'll just drop a comment down below. I'll see you on the next one.